Oh, you're right here. <laughs> what the fuck does this guy got on his back? It's a fucking barrel of wine, baby. Yeah, Link, you ever been down here? Um, I can't remember. I think you did show me this before. I did. I think so. Yeah, we got the wine cellar down here. There's no wine. You see? Look. Yeah. Oh my god, even have, we actually have barrels already. <laughs> oh my god, this is so perfect. What the fuck? Right? All right. So That's why I really want the so check wine, this bro. Out. Check this out. Boom. Go ahead and... Wait, uh, you actually could place it? Yeah, yeah. Go ahead and, uh, you know, look at it. What? Go and... Uh, That's sick. You, know, you see the label there? Yeah, so view label. It says unnamed nine days, grapes 1200. Extra sweet. Ooh, okay. Oh, that's fucking dope. Yeah, so this is a red wine, you know, sweet red. It's about nine days old. Uh, we have a fuck ton. When I mean a fuck ton, I mean a fuck ton of barrels aging right now. Beautiful. But uh, essentially what we can do for you, I I'm actually curious. Can you grab this bottle and see if you can pour it yourself? All right, let me check. All right, use it, I guess. No, so you look at the uh, look at the barrel again and just pour the bottles, you know? Oh, okay, okay. Bottle of wine, yeah, I'm bottling up. Oh, perfect. Now go ahead and pour them, and you'll see uh, what's going to happen. I hate Make sure you got room in your pockets. Yeah, I got room. Oh, what the, what the fuck just happened? <laughs> now you get, about, yeah, you get about six bottles of wine. Now go ahead and use one of those bottles. Okay. Oh, shit. You pretty much have like you can customize the label, the the name, the description, anything you want in the bottle, essentially, right? This is nuts. Yeah, and then you can even uh, you know lay you, you know make the bottle uh, you know look like a, I'll show you. Give me one of the bottles. I'll show you what I mean. Okay, here you go. Should I give me one of the bottle photos we have? Check artwork. Uh, uh, I was trying to think of any other like little minor things. Oh, we do have employee parking um, on that side of the door. Yes, boss. Wait, where is it? All right, now check this out. See that? Wait, what the fuck? Yeah, so you can pretty much label it and you know customize it to whatever you want. And then if you can look at the wine there and see, you know, it's aged about nine days. It's a sweet red. Bro, that is legit as fuck. Holy shit. And then what you can, what you can also do is you can take this. Go ahead and take this box right here. Okay. You All can right. pretty much do the same thing. You can label it. Uh, you know, you want to make it, a, you know, get some crates or whatever you want. If you, if you get what I'm saying. Uh, I don't whatever you want. Exactly. Yeah, exactly. No, exactly. That is actually fucking dope as fuck. Oh my god. Yeah, bro. I actually, bro. You know how sick it would be, like having a bunch of wine barrels down here, let them age. Yeah, I mean, you literally have you. a fucking a fucking cellar. So, what yeah. we can do for you is we can set up uh, some sort of deal where we just give you uh, barrels. We already have them aging, but then you can bring them okay. down here and then choose whenever you wanna, you know, how long you wanna age them for. I know. Now I'm gonna be. That's I'm gonna shoot legit. straight with you, Vinny. Um. For me to break even, I have to sell a barrel for twelve thousand dollars. Damn! And you get six bottles, and it's like you four get glasses six bottles. Per bottle, right? That that bottle, that empty bottle I bought there, cost me six grand alone. Holy shit! Yeah, a barrel is about twelve hundred bucks, and then I have to fertilize the fields, which cost me about ten grand a plane I pull out to fertilize. It's a, it's a whole it's a whole fucking money sink for me if I'm being you know real with you. Now, I don't okay, mind so, selling you the barrels at break even for 12000 I want you to make some profit. I mean, it's, it's the business, you know? Like, I don't want you to get fucked. Uh, you know, I mean, business, I don't... At the end of the day, business is business, you know what I'm saying? Like, that's just the way it is. Yeah, but I don't mind kind of using uh, Maldini's as my free... Uh, like, if we be, it'll, it'll essentially be free publicity for me, which in turn will make me money. I if mean, I had, if I, I, I'm if down I, with it. Yeah, if I have a restaurant that's actually pushing out wine bottles and people are like, oh, shit, you know, where'd you get this? You know, word of mouth and all that shit. That's probably going to bring me more customers. So what's the... Okay, so 12K for a, a barrel. You get six You get six bottles. Guys, so he what, doesn't what know about the heroin. Be, uh, what is the that's why we don't care about breaking even. Fucking myth. So uh, I think you would have to sell... 
I personally would sell bottles and not glasses. Yeah, hundred percent. But if you did that, I think you'd have to sell. Uh, you what? You get like two k a bottle. Plastics. So if you sold like twenty five hundred, three thousand a bottle, uh, you would you would profit. You wouldn't profit much, but it would you would have a profit margin. I don't even there. care about the profit. I just want to see the movement of wine in the fucking pizzeria. That's that's my main objective. I could give two fucks about the profit because Maldini's makes the profit as is. I just want to see you know help you out in the sense of moving fucking wine. And then on top of it, the, you know, Maldini's actually getting wine here finally. Yeah. So what we can do is you can, you can even just sell it for $2,000 a bottle. And then we can just set up a system where I have my delivery guys bringing you barrels. I don't know, like we can do like 10 barrels a week or however much you want. Really depends on how fast yeah. you move it. And let's, uh, uh, yeah, let's, well, let's start Monday. Let's start Monday. Um, yeah. we'll start with, uh, we'll start with four barrels. Uh, we'll have them set up here. I'll let like maybe two of them age and then we're going to start pushing out the wine yeah. and we're going to get all the labels done and everything and we'll see how it goes. And depending on how people like it, I'm just fucking sitting here waiting for my seating to get done because I can't get my seating fixed. Yeah. But a lot now of the, people come here on dates. That's the thing. Yeah. And the cool thing about the barrels too, is like you can stack them like up on these walls. Like you can place them. Uh, you have time. C come with me. You have time to go somewhere real quick. I'll show you what yeah, I mean. Yeah, come on. Yeah. Before, yeah, my wife's we're just going out for dinner, but let's go. It'll be very quick, very quick. <laughs> my heart. Uh my car's over here. Probably gonna buy the fucking Rolls Royce. Yeah, it looks fucking sick. Now, I'll tell you as well, I'm going to try to get things to be cheaper because I just uh, I just can't operate with my cost right now in reality, but... Oh, of course not. And, uh, you know, if things get cheaper too, we can work out uh, better deals. Okay, so basically with each barrel, I would need an empty bottle, right? Is that how it goes? You would need an empty bottle, but... Uh, we would we would supply the bottles because uh, that cover like what you're paying for is that bottle as well in that okay. twelve thousand. You know okay. what I mean? Perfect. Yeah, you're not paying an extra six on top of that. So we so let's say you like you, you let's say you wanted the four barrels on Monday, we would bring you four empty bottles as well. All right, beautiful. Yeah. Perfect. And then it's just one empty bottle uh, per barrel, so it kind of covers all that cost. That's why we have to price it that way. Now check this out. What the fuck? This is sick. Yeah, we're uh, we got two sellers actually. This is that we had to expand because we had a smaller seller down down the road on Vinewood uh, that we this just packed dope. to the brim. So and I was starting to fucking you pack can this shit. Stack them on top of one another. Yeah. Bro, you know it'd be sick if I could actually put them in. You see how like the barrel uh, the barrel uh, fucking rack I have down there? If they actually go there sideways, would be absolutely. You can insane. actually place them sideways as well. Wait, what? Yeah, you just have oh to angle God. it correctly. And the cool thing about it is that uh, I don't know how to explain this, but whoever puts it down, that's the only person that can pick them back up. So people can't fuck with your shit. You know what I mean? Oh, beautiful. Yeah. Well, I can make a fortress down in the fucking basement. Yeah, don't tell nobody, but you can literally carry one on your back and people can't shoot you in the back. <laughs> <laughs> so back in the day, like oxygen tanks. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> But yeah, that's yeah, uh, yeah, so I'll work over the business, weekend. Uh, I think we start on Monday. We'll bring you four barrels. So we can just mm -hmm. we can even just do a tester. I don't, I don't even mind just supplying you uh, four barrels for free just to see how it goes. No, no, I, no, I'll just pay it. I don't care. All right. I'm telling you, a lot of people ask for wine. They're like, oh, you know, why does the pizzeria have wine? I'm like, you know, because that along I've been asking Dean before our storm got hit. I'm like, yo, let's get like I need wine in the pizzeria. And he's like, oh, something's coming. Something's coming. And then bang, this is perfect. You know? Yeah, and then we'll just we can just supply you anything. Like I said, if you want to just keep buying barrels and like we have, for example, we have a barrel that we're going to have aged for a year and we're not going to okay. open that until a year from now because it's the first barrel we ever made. You know, so you can do cool shit like that with people to kind of sell that sort of experience. You know what I mean? Yeah, vintage status. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. All right. Perfect. Like, yeah, Monday, let's start getting cracking on this and I'll we'll definitely stop pushing this out. All right. I'll set up a delivery for Monday and I'll see you then. All right, brother. Thank you so much. Lang. All right. Thanks, Vinny. Have a good time of dinner. Dude, it's crazy. It's so sick that he actually has like a cellar too. It feels so aesthetically pleasing down there.
to have like barrels and to be making wine down there, you know? 